YouTube, Niner Empire, we have some rumors on uh, the Jimmy Garoppolo situation. Um, it's being reported um, that the 49ers could potentially get a low first round pick or a high second round pick uh, for Jimmy G due to this year's upcoming draft class um, not really being, you know, um, top tier, I guess you could say. Everybody knows this draft class, um, this this year's upcoming draft class, really, I mean, there's there's not that very many quarterbacks. To be completely honest, this is like the first draft class that I really haven't looked at and followed um, or really even heard much about. Um, obviously, last year, you know, Justin Fields, Trey Lance, um, Trevor Lawrence, the list goes on, um, you know, uh, but there's something about this draft class that's weird, and I don't know what it is. I don't know, you know, um, if, if the talent's just not there or it hasn't been there. I don't know exactly what it is, but there's reports going around out there on Twitter that the 49ers could potentially get a low first-round pick or a high second-round pick in return uh, for Jimmy G. So, look, I would be shocked, absolutely shocked, no matter how, you know, bad this draft class may be, um, or how untalented this draft class may be, I don't see us getting anywhere near a first-round pick. Now, I I guess a second-round pick is kind of near. I definitely could see us probably getting a second-round pick, maybe if it's a team like the Indianapolis Colts or the um, the Washington football team. But um, I don't know. Something about, something about a, a low first-round pick for Jimmy G just does not sit right. Uh, don't get me wrong. Obviously, if the 49ers, you know, get offered that, I would expect them, you know, to to accept that without any hesitations. But um, it, I don't know. It, it's definitely weird. And like I said, I mean, it, I definitely at the most could see a second round pick. That's what I think the Niners could get at most. Now, maybe if they get into a, uh, you know, some type of bidding war with with the Pittsburgh Steelers or the Washington football team or the Colts, whatever, whoever is involved, maybe you know, two couple teams get into a betting war um, with, the, uh, you know, the 49ers on Jimmy Garoppolo, and maybe we could punch out a, a first out of a team then, but I, I just don't think Jimmy G is good enough for any teams to be in a betting war with. Um, and obviously, people know his ceiling. For, I, if there's, there's one thing for certain, the Pittsburgh Steelers will, will probably not trade a first or a second round pick for Jimmy Garoppolo. They are too smart and they understand, you know, that Jimmy G is mediocre at best. Um, so, like, I mean, if any team, and this goes back to my last video, I told you guys that if, if there's any team out there that I think the 49ers um, um, could trade for, um, or if there's any team out there that the 49ers would negotiate with a trade, um, it would probably be the Colts and the Washington football team before it is the Pittsburgh Steelers. Now, the Pittsburgh Steelers could be involved, but they're not worried about getting into a bidding war or anything like that. And I think at best, we could probably get a third rounder, a mid-third rounder out of Pittsburgh. Um, but like I said, I mean, I think the 49ers would have a better shot getting better draft value in a trade with the, the Washington football team or the Indianapolis Colts. So... Um, and I would also even throw Miami in there. Um, I know Mike McDaniel just got hired, and he's almost kind of committed to Tua. There's there's actually rumors out there that Mike McDaniel I, – I think i seen Grant Cohn tweet it. Mike McDaniel must have raved and must have almost been forced to talk good on Tua Tagovailoa in order to get that Dolphins job. Um, I, who knows if that really happened. I thought it was just pretty funny, but um, – I could see Miami, Mike McDaniel, 49ers offensive coordinator, just took the job there. Jimmy's familiar. Obviously, I'm sure the system is probably going to be the same. And um, I could definitely see Mike McDaniel and that Dolphins team making a move for him. Um, but it's seeming, it, it really does look like they're going to stick with Tua, um, as they should. I don't think, you know, they should move on from Tua yet, but... You know who knows? Maybe they, they could they could trade for Jimmy G just to use him as a backup in case in, in case two is not working or working out for them or whatnot. But it'll be interesting. Uh, but I mean these there's been reports like I said uh, high or uh, a low first round pick 
or a potential second, uh, high second round pick um, in a Jimmy Garoppolo trade. Um, we'll see what happens, but I, I personally don't see it happening. I think at getting a first round pick out of any team would be um, pretty surprising to me, especially for Jimmy Garoppolo. So we'll see what happens, but um, yeah, go Niners.